talking about measuring and using numbers in scientific scales. Measuring is a skill to make observations using numbers and standard unit tools. Do you know what are the tools used for measuring? This is a ball. Now we are going to measure the circumference of the ball. The best measurement tool to measure the circumference of a ball is measurement tape. This is because the ball is round in shape and a measuring tape is a flexible ruler which can follow the shape of the ball. Now I am going to show you how to measure the ball using the measuring tape. One side of the tape is in inches and another side is in cm. So, let me show you how to measure it in cm. It's about 46.3 cm. This is a toy car. We're going to measure how long it takes to stop moving. The best way to measure the time taken by the car to stop moving is by using a stopwatch. This is because stopwatch is a handheld timepiece which is designed to measure the amount of time that elapses between the activation and deactivation. To use a stopwatch, you will need to press the start button at the beginning of an event and then press the stop button to stop at the ending of an event. Usually, start and stop are the same button. To use again, you just need to press the reset button. Let me show you how to use. It took 2.5 seconds for the car to stop. This is an orange. Let's find out the weight of an orange. The best measurement tool to find out the weight is using a weighing scale. This is because weighing scales measure the weight or mass of an item and provide the reading in grams, kilograms, pounds, ounces or stones. Before you measure, ensure that the scale is pointing at zero gram. If not, you'll need to adjust it. We are going to weigh the orange now. Check out the reading. The orange is 250 gram. This is a book. We are going to measure the length of this book. The best measurement tool to use to measure the length is a ruler. This is because ruler is used to measure a straight line. Let me show you how to measure the length. Just ensure when you are recording the measurement, your eye position is straight facing the measurement point. It's 11.7 cm. I hope you like my video and please check out all of the other videos in my channel. Thank you for all those who subscribe to me and if you have not done so, please do it by clicking the subscribe button once. Bye!